Hey guys, Richard here from the School of Nomads. So in this review, I want to talk about a product called Write App Reviews. In a nutshell, what you're doing is you're being paid to test apps on your phone and write reviews. Now, the main thing is here that you actually write reviews and you actually get paid by various advertisements on the actual website where you write the reviews. So my name is Richard Darby. This is the School of Nomads. If you haven't been over to this channel before, please hit the subscribe and notification bell. And I'll let you know whenever we do new reviews. And if you want our blueprint for building a business online, go ahead and hit the link in the description below. And I'll let you know the whole process step by step. So I'm now going to jump over and actually purchase this. And I'll see you on the other side. Okay guys, so I'm actually going to purchase this live in front of you so you know that I'm actually testing this and not just showing you the front page. So we're here at writeappsreviews.com. This is a product that was on Clickbank. First thing you do is put your name and your email address in here to get instant access. Okay, so there's a sales page here. Three simple steps. Choose an app, write a post and then affiliate income. Okay, so it's $27 to join on the front end. I'll go ahead and pay for this and I'll come back once I paid for it. Okay guys, um, I'm inside the members area now. So the first thing you see is this screen here. And now there's a number of steps that they ask you to go through. And essentially what this is, is basically they're providing a WordPress site that you write reviews to, and then people are expected to come across those reviews and within the pages of those reviews, there's affiliate links on things like banners and there's some kind of download on there as well. So this is completely different to what I expected it to be, but they give you kind of a three step process to get started with. You have to go ahead and set up your affiliate links with the major networks. So if I come across here, you've got a ClickBank sign up there and you've got a JVZoo sign up there. For those that aren't aware, they're kind of two of the big digital affiliate networks. So you've got to go ahead and sign up for them you then have to actually log into the site itself and you'll see there's a bunch of apps on the site that have been pre-prepared for you and you go ahead and basically download those apps to your phone and then go ahead and do a review for those apps so they do write some basic information here for the reviews but there's nothing else really as far as training it's more about just adding the odd image and how to add media and then go ahead and publishing. So they're kind of making it easy for you to do the reviews in fairness. So on step three, they're giving you kind of the three ways you make money here. So the first one is ad banners. So on the top of each one of these WordPress sites, there's an ad banner that they've got an affiliate link under. So you'll get paid a commission if somebody clicks on that and buys something. The second one is email opt-in list. Now these emails are kept on their servers, not yours. So you don't actually build a list with this. What you're just doing is if they click on the link, once they start getting offers or they click a link within the actual download that they have you'll end up generating a commission and the third one then is once they download the app they get redirected to a page where there's further offers then potentially you'll get paid a commission this is kind of classic affiliate marketing you see lots of sites that do this the lots of sites have banners they have downloads they have redirect pages once you click on something so this isn't an unusual thing but there's a few issues with this so i'm just going to jump over to the site itself this is the site that they actually give you right so this is a kind of a slim down wordpress site where they have just a, an area for posts for app reviews for your affiliate ids to go in and then a few settings here and then what you have here is on the bottom you have some scrolling apps that you can go ahead and do a review so the idea is you would download say dinosaur ocean explorer and then you would write your review based on playing that so if i just go ahead and click that so all they have actually pre-populated here for me is the actual title of this article and then you'll see in the permalink there you've got dinosaur ocean explorer and then nothing else the first issue with this is you know, to make these articles actually show up in Google, they've got to be keyword rich, they've got to be written well, the content's got to be good. So you're not even going to get anyone to see this unless you write a really nice article with lots and lots of information. But if you are good at reviews, there is a second issue already with this, I see, that everything is hosted on their website. So if you were going to go ahead and build a business based on these particular reviews and you're expecting to get commissions on a long-term basis, then you're doing everything on their servers. Uh, this Richard Darves Fish Fresh App Reviews dot com is the website that these are being actually hosted on. 
So there's a big issue there. It's on their website, and then there's there's no real kind of detail here for the reviews. But once I do the review, what will happen is you come up here on the actual dashboard, and this is where it'll end up. So that's the actual front page of this dashboard, and there'll be some reviews here. Obviously, they've already pre-populated one here. Let's click on this one, this red karaoke to show you. And that's what the actual review will look like. There'll obviously be more information here. And then there's a banner here that you'll be paid on. And on this one, this download, our free report isn't working. And also, as I noticed, you can't see it on your view, but this site is not secure. So Google won't even show this site, right? They won't even show it if it's not secure. You won't even get anybody to click on it. So that's kind of what the site looks like. And if I just go back, and once I'm back, I just want to look at Dinosaur Ocean Explorer. Because what I'm trying to understand is how is anybody going to find this particular app? through one of these sites. If you look on Google, the first page of Google on my end, you have the play.com store, Amazon, Amazon, books, Lego. You're gonna to have to go through about a thousand pages where you come across this particular article. Once you start writing them because they're not gonna show up on the front page of Google. So you're not gonna have anybody clicking on these. There's the, the, the actual domain itself is gonna have no authority whatsoever. Plus, there'll be a thousand other people doing the same thing as you for this particular one because all of these sites will be the same. So you'll be reviewing the same app. So what it is, a kind of scattergun approach where they're just trying to get as many people as they can to actually come on here and review the apps with the hope that one or two of them might eventually make some form of sale and be happy to stay with them. So I'm back on the actual site themselves. You know, in, in conclusion, I know this is going to be a shorter type review. This is garbage. I wouldn't go anywhere near it. The actual concept itself is right, that you have affiliate links in things like banners and you can download a free report. The product itself is very, very poor quality. It relies on you writing some credible reviews to get anywhere near the authority in a search engine for people to come across it. And the, just, the competition is gonna to be too much. When you look at most of these apps, when you go to the Google Play Store, People don't really go out into Google and start looking for reviews. They actually search underneath the Google Play Store for the reviews. The other thing to note here is that this is exactly the same, exactly the same site as a product called AppCoiner. So this is being sold under a different name, but this site here, AppCoiner.com, is exactly the same site. If I look at these things, all they've done is change the actual coloring of the site. I would steer clear of AppCoiner as well because it's going to be the same issues so you're going to have a very low quality wordpress site that won't be found by anybody and you spend a lot of effort writing reviews with very very little in the form of commissions you might get lucky but i don't see how google are actually going to come across one of these reviews and also don't ever think that people are going to be actually searching for these reviews within google because they use things like the app store to actually go ahead and look at other people's reviews before they go and purchase them so guys, I hope you enjoyed this review. The The concept's right, but the actual execution of this this software is, is really poor. So hopefully I, was, I can save you a little bit of money by steering clear of this particular money-making opportunity. If you want to hear more reviews like this and they're not always this negative, please go ahead and hit the subscribe and notification bell and I'll let you know whenever I re release my next video. And if you want to get our blueprint for building a real business online, go ahead and check out the link in the description below and I'll take you through it step by step. Until next time, guys, take care.